have another dose! All right, Druid it is. Let's play Druid. Let's go. All right, so let's go Hidden Oasis. Let me do this. Get these up. We'll try, Hadesh. We'll try. It has been for me too, but we can always try. Let's take a broom. Try and get a cleave with the broom. Bees is a good card. Oh, Frost Wolf is excellent, but Night Captain is better. Let's try Night Captain. Those are all good. <sighs> oh my, what do we take here? Another Night Captain, I guess, right? What do you think here, chat? This one's tough. I think it's just another Night Captain, right? Yeah, they're pretty bad, right? They're pretty bad. Yeah, I wish we could have all of them. I think we just go Night Captain. Let's try that. Oh, Nordrasil Druid? I like Bone Wraith, but the Druid can be interesting, right? Yeah, Trixor, that's what you get for the class, right? These are the win rates. Yeah, so we've got the win rates on the left and the Hearth Arena score on the right. Let's try Druid. I like it too. Tower Sergeant could be really good. Good luck. Thank you for the cheer, Arch. Appreciate it, man. Appreciate all the cheers and stuff. Let's take a Raven Idol. I think Raven Idol is interesting. Soul of the Forest ain't bad. Yeah, appreciate the cheer, Arch. Thank you for your support, man. And uh, thank you for the good luck. I think Raven Idol is interesting. An interesting way of finding something when we need it. Soul of the Forest isn't bad, though. With bees or something, but... Let's try Raven Idol. Now I'll take a Frost Wolf. I need twos. There's a two. Proto's pretty good though. What do you think here? Yeah, exactly. So uh, usually cards are better on average if uh, they're above 40%. Proto, Proto, Proto. Yeah, me too. I have, Arch. I have. Let's take Proto. I did, John. Another Tower Sergeant, sure. I, I really need early game now. I think another Night Captain. Now we have to focus on early game. Bunker. Sneaky. Uh, Pride Seeker? I do have Hidden Oasis. But probably still sucks, right? I have Raven Idol as well, but this is a 2-4. It's not really that good, is it? Probably just a Hothead or Soul, what do you think? I don't feel like this deck does well with Soul of the Forest. Hey, JD Baker. Uh, um, nothing much, just chilling with some Druid. I'm not too bad, though. What do you think here, chat? Swag thinks Soul? Uh, I'm actually not sure. Win rates point towards Pride Seeker, but I'm not sure. Hothead. Yeah, the 3 ma 2 4 stat line is a bit bad. <laughs> yeah, it's true, John. Pride Seeker, but all it does is let me get the 6-6 six, six out for, for 4, really. Or I also have to draw them, right? We have a bunch of fours, but I may take Soul of the Forest because of Nordrasil Druid and Bees. Good luck, though. No, good luck. We don't really stout. None of them really work. Yeah, we're gonna find more choose one cards. Let's try it. Ram Commander. Bug Collector. Owl. I mean, Electrolyte ain't too bad. Maybe just tokens. Yeah, let's take tokens. Early game. I'll take a Smug Senior or another Frostwolf. What about here? Smug Senior is pretty good, right? I think I need fours. And do I need fours, though? But this is sticky is the thing, right? It's a sticky minion. I like Smug. I don't know. I like Smug. DID? Sure. Couple more twos and threes, chat. I don't like Nourish. The first wolf is good, but I like Smug too. 
Nourish is interesting because it's draw when you really need it, but Bark Skin can be really good. What about here? I may take Bark Skin to help my early game actually get to my mid game kind of thing. Helps me stick Tower Sergeants. If anything, Nourish would be draw. Which is about it. And I want to get there quicker. I'm going to use Bark Skin. Take Bark Skin, sorry. Uh, just Bark Skin again. Guardian Animals gives me... Frostwolf? Yeah, I'll take Bark Skin. Another Anomaly? I need twos and threes, chat. I need twos and threes. Ice Huff? I'm not a big fan of Ironwood Golem, and Frost Saber Matriarch sucks in this deck, right? We only have one beast. Two, I guess, technically, right? Because of summoning. Uh, three, four, five, actually, technically, right? And bees. Wait a second, wait a second. Bees counts, right? Four. You do have two bark skins. Oh, the Ironwood got him? Yeah, but Matriarch. Uh, we actually have one, two, three, seven, eight, nine beasts. So this could be zero, right? This could be zero. Should we try a Matriarch? Yeah, let's try it. A corporate? Yes, please. Uh, really need more early game. The 4 is okay, but I think I'll take a Squire and try and get it to stick. Um, Ice Revenant is the other option, which is okay. It's okay, but I'll take a Squire. Power of the Wild, probably. Mage Scribe is good late game value, but I need early game. I'm going to take a Power of the Wild. Now maybe a Mage Scribe over Steward of Scrolls, sure. Another Frostwolf over the others, for sure. Wow. My early game is kinda bad, but four Knight Captains? Let's go! Let's go! This is probably the best Druid I've ever drafted. Could it be my first infinite? With Druid? It would be my first infinite, I'm telling you. It would be my first infinite with Druid. The issue is I'm not sure we ever get there. <laughs> like, I'm actually gonna chuck Knight Captain because we probably draw it, right? Let's find twos and stuff. Something like that. Yeah, Operation Lift to turn five sounds about right. Bottom left, buddies? No way, you did it? Lana did it? Lana did it? Come on, Lana, pop up, Lana, pop up. I'm waiting for it, I'm waiting for it. Lana killing it. Lana killing it. Studies? Sure. Oh, bees? Yeah, 12 and 2. Congratulations, Lana. So I could do this. And then Power of the Wild the next turn? Sure. Yeah. I agree, Stout. Druid never has removal, so it's what you always want to do. Carderon, thanks for the follow. No, 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 no. That's not good for us. I actually do think I bees here. Uh, into Tower Sergeant Power of the Wild or something like that. At least no bunker. I have to hope. I have to hope there, Trixar, I think. So I could buff here. I think I do. 
I could buff hero power or arcane anomaly buff. Buff hero power is better on mana. Or I could just tower sergeant. I think a buff before things go wild. Something like this. Wow, yeah, you're killing it, Lana. You are killing it. Okay, next time we can Anomaly Tower Sergeant. So even something like a Lightning Storm is fine for us. They could have Wild Pub, but it's okay. Yeah, Cardron reminds me, you know, uh, it's a good as time as any to drop me a follow on Twitch. You know, hop on the train at Cardron's driving. That's insane, Lana. What average is that? Has to be 8-ish, right? 7, 14, 21. And 24. 45 over 5. Is that 9? It's a 9 average, right? Yeah. It's a 9 average. That's really good, Lana. nice ring you can sing it you want me to sing is that it oh the, the, the win rates 712 7712 now your next ones are gonna be 777 12 12 12 7 of course 12 12 12 7 7 Vishadio with the follow appreciate it as well thank you very much welcome everyone has this shaman given up Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm very up and down myself, Stout. What I would like to do is do a little bit of focusing to try and get something going, maybe. So, uh, for example, on, on NA, I started out really well. 775988866. And I went 3232-2231. 11, 12, 8, 3, 1, 1, 10, 3, 4, 12, 6. <laughs> like that little uh, interim thing. Not good. Yeah, that was a really bad streak. One. Ease peas, chat. That probably was uh, one of those days where we had a low row with a, with a run, Mafundi. I think we had... Let me see what, what class is. Yeah, it was... Uh, I had a low row with a rogue, and then we picked warrior for memes, and I low rolled a hunter, and then we low rolled a warlock, and I low rolled a rogue, and then we tried a warrior, and then I low rolled a hunter. <laughs> and a mage, actually. And then we got an 11 hunter, and then we got a 12 rogue. And then we lower all the priest, three, and then we lower all the mage, one. Then we lower all the warlock, three, and the mage, four. That's amazing, Lana. And I think I actually keep these two. Maybe, maybe not. Yeah, let's keep him. Well, there's a knight captain. Kessie. How are you doing, Kessie? Hello, hello, hello. Alright, one. I may honestly just power of the wild next turn, depending on what they do. Uh, no, it's here. So it's never in my lap. It's always on my desk, just resting on my keyboard. But yeah, I have chat open there. Well, seeing as they're going to skip next turn, I think I'm fine with bark skin here. like turn two kill their minion get a two two all right sure tired make yourself some tea rest up rest up i think i actually summon a three two here that's one beast surprise zoski's not asleep as well and uh, now we have curve right or do we what do we do now I think we just go face, right? So I can hero power trade, but I think we just go face. Let them take this trade. I'll night captain it next turn even maybe into smug scene here. Hmm. 
Okay, so we can't Night Captain something interesting, unfortunately. But we can push more face like this. Ah, How sweet, Gessie. Well, there you go. We're actually drawing really poorly here. Uh, actually just drawing it the other way around, basically, right? Fire Ellie. It's pretty good. I think now I do trade and uh, drop this. We'll be fine. It wasn't that Mr. Tobogganator, double sun-dried tomatoes and anchovies. Ugh. It's almost as if they like eel. No, no, no. Les, Les likes eel. Tobogganator likes something else, right? Um, kind of rough, actually. I guess I could heal this back to full, but I guess I just want a 6-6 six, six here, right? Just take this trade. Oi, oi, Kessie. Alright, Proto next turn. Let's see what they do. Now, I'm telling you, Lana. Uh, before I got a few good shamans in a row, shaman was and remains to be... Uh, and remains to be until that point. A bad class for me. I'm telling you. Uh, just do this. Wow, Hadesh. That's insane. It's insane. Order lull for them? Yeah, the 2-2 two -two you mean, right? I'm not sure though, because I think they needed the the one mana spell to activate. I'm not sure though. I guess we spectral senior one hero power. I could get a six six up, but I like the taunt. Oh the Thanos. Yeah, actually that's true. Yeah, that's that's actually the average shaman in my opinion, Lana. It's weird, but that's how I feel. Do we just smash face here, chat? They're gonna roll a taunt. No. He is strong though. Ram. I think we go face, right? Four, five, six. Because all the ones you see above like four wins uh, will always have that. I think we do this, 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 this. So this is cheaper now. I missed that. I think we're doing this, this, and this. Like, wait, that's, for me, at least personally, I would say at least 70% of my shamans are exactly like that. And then the other 30% usually are the exact opposite. Uh, knight commanders, uh, knight captains are our reach, basically. Druid never really has reach, right? Interesting. You're trying. They miss damage. They try and find a taunt. I think you always find a taunt, right? Or do you? Maybe not, actually. Beryl? Oh, wow. Wait, was Feral free? That doesn't go face. Come on. That would be too broken. Oh my. This is so close. What do we do? Eight here. Kill this. And then they have... 8, 16, 24, 25 on board, so the taunt only just saves me. Time, 
I don't have any other option except to do this. They actually have one off lethal if they can clear the taunt. Uh, I really like that the bees and the frost saber matriarch really work. Uh, if they have an answer to my taunt and one damage, they just win here, right? They just win. That's a good sign. They can just clear though, right? Ah. Uh, uh, so if they go face... No, they're trading. So nothing saves me now. GG. I would have gone to 10. I think Trixer, yeah. They went to 10 on this instead, I guess. That was close. That was close. Nah, they never give up. But why would I do that, my fundy? I don't want to hide it, but why would I want to share it on purpose? Nice, Lana. Let's see you get another 11. Ah, uh, nah, nah. I don't think they would have. I'm going to full mild these. Uh, I usually like keeping Night Captain, but with so many Night Captains, we're bound to hit others. Yeah, it was also a good deck, right? What was it? Triple Primordial. They had the AoE, Valpira, Fire Elemental, Blood Guard, uh, Unstable Evolution, right? Another 11 wins, Lana, to get 12. See? Another 11 wins. I think I just bark skin here, keep the coin. <laughs> that doesn't work at this. Okay, okay. Can I, can I please draw a bit better? Like, I'm playing a druid. Can I at least not draw my deck the other way around? Thank you, that helps. Uh, okay. Wind chill, sure. Give me three health. Four health works as well. No. Now what am I gonna knight captain? Do I still knight captain? I think I do. Otherwise, what am I doing? Squire hero power? Nah, let's do this. <laughs> I'm telling you, if you play Druid with a bad deck, it's like... Okay, okay, okay. That gives me a Knight Captain target, actually. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Looking good, Chad, looking good. So we do this. And then we smug senior to protect and mash face, chat. Um Okay. Interesting, interesting. So uh, if I hero power I can get through. Ah they tried, they try. I think I actually hero power. We're doing this and this. And then this. And then this and this and this. Alright, lethal is a lethal setup. 6, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Lethal setup. What are you gonna do? Earthquake me? You know you don't have earthquake. What is this hex? Can I rap? If you include a W, maybe. I can rap with W. I think I'm gonna wrap her actually with a W though. They have they have AoE. What was that? 
What you gonna do when the EQ jumps right on you, brother? The will of the Forsaken is unbreakable. Potentially, which is why I uh, took a trade there. So this heals them for 3, 6, 9, 12 and leaves me 7 on board. Which is rough, but then I can drop a proto. Oh no, this stays alive as well. I forgot about that. So, wrap without an E now, come on. So basically, Ben Hassan, my idea was to do that. Uh, to play around Tidal. Because I expected a Tidal, because it was a kind of weird play. Man, come on, dude. I played Fireheart. I never even got offered once. I never even once got offered that card. You know how many times I search for Plague of Murlocs with Fireheart chat in that Shaman we played before? Quite a bit, I would say. We never even saw it. Like, we even were searching for it in particular, right? Yeah, Plague of Murlocs, stout. Uh, off of Instructor Fireheart, actually. Uh, which means they have another spell. That we don't know what it is, discovered, right? Fireheart is a cool card. Fireheart is a cool card. Alright, well, we still have a chance here. We still have a chance. As long as what they're doing is healing and stuff, I think we're doing all righty. Alright, what's gonna happen now? That's fine-ish. That's fine. Completely fine, right? Okay, so I think I want to bunker second. So we're gonna do this. 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 And this. Unfortunate. Not sure what they're gonna do now. I almost had lethal, but how does how do they deal with this board? Second plague? Even then it's tough. They need something like second plague into AoE. Ah. Ah. Yes. Freeze, boy. Yes. The issue now is they can get the hugest of hugest Gidras, but uh, I don't see them clearing. Especially if they're knocking the Vine Shield off with that. Wrecked by Deathwing? Yeah, I have done by Wrecked by Deathwing before as well. Alright, well... That trade is a good sign, to be honest with you. Earthquake clears now. Actually leaves a 1-1. One, one, but it does give them a... Uh... No, this dies as well, right? What do they need here? A tidal wave, maybe? Survival. How in the what now? How in the what now? Do me a favor, please. Get How? Out of here. In the what now? Get out of here, man. Shit, I'm saying. This has to die. Oh. These, these just have to die.
Oh my, so what, what have we faced? Fireheart into Plague of Murlocs to save them. A Tidal Wave and then another Tidal Wave with a Snowfall Guardian and a Speaker Gidra to save them. Look at this druid, man. Look at this druid. Okay, okay, running out of steam, sort of. Ish, maybe. Is that lethal somehow? 6, 79, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Close, but not quite. Base. Base. I could have, I guess, traded, but let's kill this one. Especially with Fireheart, Double Tidal Wave, and Snowfall Guardian Poggers. But uh, we're not out of the out of the we're not out of the game yet. They're not out of the game yet. They also have spell damage, fire rally, trade. So it gives us lethal, even through a taunt trait. Woo! Two wins. All right, let's uh, let's play some more. We're winning. I love doing the winning chat. I love doing the winning. So far, so good. Thank you, Mufandi. Wow is right, Trixar. I'm keeping bunker, Sergeant. But I'm trying to find ones and twos here, chat. Is it just me, or have we consistently started with a 6 and 8 in our hand? I think we have. Every game we've had a 6 or an 8 in our hand, and we're talking like just, just 5 cards there, right? I know I don't have too many 1s and 2s, especially 2s, but anything from 1 to 3, we're talking 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, half the deck. All right, all right. No worries, we got this. We got this. So night captains are really helping us, but I wouldn't say they're winning the games for us. Nah, I won't curse for no uh, for no reason. Okay, that's fine. I guess we're hero powering. Yeah, there's another six. Uh, yes siree, Poggers. Which one do you want, man? I'll give you one for free. Tell me which one, I'll do it. You'll be a chunk of your three night captains. I only played two, and one of them didn't really count, I would say, but... I think I actually played the two here. Uh, which one though, Poggers? Which one? Uh, one of them surely did help. Surely did help. Uh, we wouldn't have needed it if they didn't high roll the fire hard though, right? I think we actually killed this one. Do I bees then? Hero power bees? I could drop a 4-4. Four, four. You had, actually, Mufundi. Hmm. Sure. Will do. I think I actually play a 4-4 four, four here. It feels weird, but I think I do. I don't want two 1-1s. One, then again, next turn I don't have a play, so... If I trade yeah, I here, this always happens. Hero power and bees. Then I have... Two bees left. Nah, we do this. Hey, Hango, lovely to see you. All right, so Kajam three first, and get out of here. How are you doing, Hango? Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Get out of here, man! Shit, I'm saying. Hango always OP, of course. 
Tango very OP. I actually don't have a good play here, do I? Wow, what do I what do I even do here? Bees this? What? Like look at my deck. I'm I've drawn this section and then this section down here. No, not up here or, or, or here in the middle. You clear the Yeti. But then I and I flow two mana. Hmm. I guess so. Should have hero powered for free last turn, right? I wish I could bark skin these before they die. She is though an insane hango. She's got like a 712, 7712. What is the pride guy? What do you mean? You just got home from work and had dinner? Mmm, dinner. That's what I said, right? Yeah, it just feels really bad, Mafundi, you know? Oh, the Pride Seeker. Uh, right, let's start with this. Uh, three mana, two, four, Poggers. A battle cry. Your next choose one card costs two less. I'm uh, good with numbers, Lana. At least I was, but my memory for numbers still works. Four, five, six. Ooh, poison, poison, poison. Uh, that's not good. Oh, Pathmaker? Yeah, it's pretty good, Mufundi. Did that count towards the Matriarch? This one? Yes. It did. Actually. Are we double trading? No need Probably. Or maybe not. Yeah, it's not. If the spit hits here, it sucks. That's better. It did actually, Mafundi. So, once Mafundi... Off stream, uh, I was playing a druid, and uh, they kept healing out of range with that three mana eight armor card plus four attacker eight armor. And then they played a deathwing. I was about to kill them. I killed the deathwing. You know what they top decked? I was at four health. Pathmaker top deck into four, into five attack face. I was at five health. So hero power plus the four from that. Unbelievable. I think we do this here. Maybe even fit this in. Feral Rage, yes, thank you. Ah, uh, okay, okay. So far, so good. We can actually draw our Proto Drake. Which is pretty interesting, I would say. Pretty interesting. See how much more wins we can fit in here, huh? Mm -hmm. In real life? Now, I've seen uh, llamas or alpacas spit, actually. And that's, uh, that's about it. Okay, this could give us a good bunker, Sergeant. Do you, do, does she actually have alpacas? Trade the camel and then rip a bunker, Sergeant. Seems really good, right? The courage of man Damn, where, where, where does she live again, country-wise? I think this is good. Let's start with a. Uh, let's start with this. Oh, this could be lethal. I mean, all the others kind of suck, so... I'll also draw my uh, Proto Drake. And... Uh, 
How about we do this? We want a spell probably. And um, we take kennel. Kennel is just pretty good. We could play kennels here. Sure. Try and set up lethal with branching pots. They like to nose poop. I, I've never heard of anyone that has their own alpacas. That's why I'm uh, I'm asking. They do look cute. They have that little furry head as well. You've seen a camera split 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 in two dromedars. I'm not even sure I know what that means. Okay, they're down to nine. This is still lethal, right? Unless they heal. I'm not sure. Let's see. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So still a, still a little bit off. Still a little bit off. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, uh, okay. I'm sorry. I'm a bit, a bit, teeny bit slow. Teeny bit slow. As I think I'm doing... Uh, this. I am trying, Poggers, but uh, telling them doesn't change the cards they have, Poggers. It really doesn't. Man, today we've had some really long runs. I've been streaming for a tad. I guess roughly around the same time as usual, but uh, we're still early on in our third run. Now, now they can assassinate my knight captain and trade and hero power. Mr. TG. Fast than a speeding bullet, more powerful than a locomotive, able to leap tall buildings in a single bound. These are some of TG's warm-up exercises. How are you doing? Mr. TG himself. Maybe does... I don't know, I mean... Imagine, Hango, that uh, they actually read your voice to try and improve their AI as to the cards that can answer your board. <laughs> like, if you're on the leaderboard, they record your voice. <laughs> and they try and uh, figure out card names. How are you doing? How's work, TG? Big, big chungus, big chungus, big chungus. Alright, let's uh, full mod those. Keep the anomaly. That is so much better. Finally a good hand. How's, uh, how's Lana doing? How you doing, Lana? Still winning? Happy oh my Happy god. Oh my. 50 people. That's insane, dude. That is insane. So I could play this, but it honestly does nothing really, right? So I'm actually gonna pass. Happy feast of winter. That is my voice, Mafundi, when I try and make it high-pitched on purpose. Ease peasy. Oh yeah, perfect. We'll just crack a corporate here. Nice. Biggie Blunt's always putting out some insane bangers, huh? Get in there and fight, oh, that's pretty good. It does give us a bunker, Sergeant. Wow, just pinging? Sure. Alright, so we can go Direwolf into Anomaly Tower, Sergeant. Seems pretty good to me. Seems pretty good to me. And I won't pre-trade. I don't think there's anything to gain. <laughs> to play around Bunker Sergeant. It's a uh, very five head, you know? Orange, you don't copy the name of the person. <laughs> Ooh, does that help? Kinda does. Not this day. Who is next 
Feast on the chopping block. You can probably find this blood puppy. What's the most five head move you have ever made? I don't know, I've painted my own face and my own minions before to actually get around stuff. That was actually good for us. Um, how do we do this? I kinda wanna double trade, actually. Trade here, oh, trade here first, trade here first, then trade here. Just get rid of this. I'm going into a flame strike turn, I do want a buff, but everything dies to flame strike, so let's just drop this and chill out a little bit. Uh, this song is loud. This song is loud. There we go. Bit more chill, bit more chill. Nice positioning. It's actually good positioning, right? I guess I could have placed this here for combustion. Ooh. Ah, I think we do play this. And then we can do this and this. Something like that. You report people, Cassie? Oh my. Oh my. Okay, that's pretty good. I do have my own trade back, so it's kind of okay. I could also buff on purpose. Oh, I have an idea. Five, six. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. One, two, three, five, six. These are two mana so I can hero power this, I guess. Yeah, might as well. You're all doing nothing wrong, otherwise I'll, I'll ban you if you do something wrong. You're all, you're all okay. So far, so good. So far, so good. I'm always on the lookout, but so far, so good. Alright, can we do some more winning here? 6, 12. How much damage can we get out? 6, 12. 13... 14, 15. I kind of want to taunt here and just set up lethal. Something like this. Take this trade. Send these dome. I don't see how they can get around this. Uh, I guess puzzle box always, right? Could have also used power of the wild. A few ways to play. Yeah, I was thinking about power of the wild the previous, but I thought better keep it for... A better situation like this one. Uh, I could have Nordrasil Druid Power of the Wild as well. I, I just like getting a Night Captain down because Night Captain down earlier means it gets more opportunity to grow more until Mage can't answer it. Drafted? Have you ever seen this, chat? I've actually never seen this. I, I didn't even know this was draftable! I didn't even know it was draftable! In this meta, my fundy! Alright, four wins, we go in, we go in chat, we do win something here! What? Aluneth! Uh, Lana, Aluneth? Al Aluneth? What, what's it called? Way back? Yeah, I didn't know it was drafted bit in this meta. Thanks for your GG, Adawak. I'm 
must protect the wild. Okay, okay. I think I full mal for early game. Uh, fours are good, fives are good, but uh, I don't want to die before I even get there. I haven't, I've never seen that play. I drafted l Lulneth. <laughs> I just faced one, Lana. I mean, uh, they were dead. It was the last card in their hand. Alright, so guess we are not getting a 12-0 druid. But can we get a 12 druid? Can we at least get an infinite? This would be my... Uh, this would mean I have all 10 classes at infinite plus this meta. I think I actually bees that. I could pride seeker, but bees seems fine. B seems fine. Three one ones on board. The only problem is uh, bunker sergeant. The courage of man Off the top. Fail. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good, Mister Deuce. It's all good. I mean, I personally don't believe in it, Kango. Yeah, because it's all within natural variance. I, I understand that you can point that out, but... There will always be those occasions, even within natural variance. I can't get a good something something going here, huh? I could use a broom to try and come back. Jinx the bad cards? Nah. We good, we chillin. Ah, I could knight captain the tutu. If I had broom, I would be able to broom trade here. Well, what are my options? Bug collector. Broom hero power. Show your pride. Is it even worth it? The Grey Warrior. I appreciate the follow. Welcome to the stream. I think we just do nothing here. I genuinely think we just do nothing. I could bark skin this, but maybe I bark skin Knight Capitan next turn. Uh, four and one right now, Kessie. Uh, four and two. I'm gonna say four and two. <laughs> After this game. Yeah. Now, and this is when we use, this is when I feel Druid starts to lose. You miss a couple draws, not even a power Knight Captain gets you back. Because then they just recon Mountain Bear you, and I don't see how Tyrion, uh, sorry, how Druid ever gets back. So I can actually broom this. For a ping, is that worth it though? I think it is. Because next turn I can mage scribe bark skin. And what are we thinking? That they have mountain bear? Recon mountain bear? What else can they have? Najak? Uh, Tyrion. Oh, that's good. That's a good sign, Chad. That's a good sign. That's not a good sign. But this was a good sign. This is a good sign. No. A good one. Hey, I got a druid minion, Chad. Look how appropriate. Look how appropriate. So I could smug instead, but I think I need to start giving myself some value. By actually going with the Mage Scribe. Smug does protect. They just use the Devolving. I mean, sure, let them trade. I think I actually buff this. Is this just always dies? That's not bad. Let's get rid of that in case they have uh, Lab Recruiter, Brewmaster, whatever. Yeah, the. One of the best druids I faced had three or four of them, Blood Puppy. It was insane. It was genuinely insane. Okay, I have to hero power that 100%. Why is this zero again? Why does this cost zero? Why did I forget? 
Why does this cost zero? Oh, oh, Pride Seeker. Right, 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 right. I think it's worth it. I get the value trade and buff a ton. Sure, sure. I think it's worth it. I'm not gonna have a much wider board. Uh, I mean, I may have like three minions or something later on, but here it gives me tempo. Uh, a bit faster, I would say. I think I have to go with the nature studies. Um, survival still exists, right, chat? Maybe... Okay, coerce. Oh, that's a good one for us. So far, so good, chat. So far, so good. We get this trade. They have to double trade. I need to put a lot of small things on the board. Yeah, like this. Okay, let's start with this. I could have actually dealt one extra damage face here. That's my miss. Just with positioning. Here or here. No hot choco, but you had a sandwich, Kessie. And now I assume you have dinner as well. I mean, that's pretty good, isn't it? This is really annoying. I wanted that bomb to go anywhere but there. It's a good draw for us. Oh no. I mean, they're gonna be drawing these forever now, aren't they? But <laughs> that's not good for us. I don't think it's good for us, at least. Oh, damn, Cassie. Oh, yeah, of course I'm gonna play it, Jack. Come on, do I go face, though? I guess I want them to draw these. I don't know. <laughs> Pasta with chicken, courgette, onion, garlic, and illusion spices. That sounds so good. Okay, so we have... That's fine, that's fine. We're looking for... <laughs> This is just an Astral Tiger, Necrium Blade, Insane Synergy kind of deck. It's, it's beautiful, it's beautiful. 10, 12, 9, 9, 11, man. Okay, okay, so this... Always happens. And I think, let's see, 11, 4, 8, 9, 10, 11. 4, so killing the 4 or 5 makes a huge difference here, so I'll kill it. And then might as well do this, I guess, right? I could pre-hit here. Oh, I hope it's all good, Chippy. I hope it all gets good. The outside weather, it's uh, kind of rough, though. Alright, so I think our average top deck is now better than theirs. Taking the nine. Shuffling another tiger. <laughs> Tigers for life, chat. Are they full trading? Yes, Tout, I did, I did, I did. Mage Scribe into Nature Studies, into Survival. Do we prefer a 12 12 here? I think we just want to do this. See them on, say that. <laughs> They're always gonna top deck a tiger, aren't they? 
Oh, baby. I thought we were going to lose this. What are the chances he doesn't draw a tiger? But they have 20 cards and 7 tigers. So, I think 40% roughly to draw a tiger. <laughs> Glad to hear, Shippy. Alright, five wins. That's uh, pretty damn good, I would say. Pretty damn good. Alright, alright. Just a few more wins, chat. A few more wins. Let's go. Impressive. Thank you, Hadesh. Alright, Ram Commander, it's really nice. I think I uh, do something like this. I know, right? Hang on. <laughs> I know. Alright, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Come on, two more wins. That's what I'm asking for. That's what I'm asking for. What's the MVP of this deck? I'm not sure. It feels like a little bit of this and a little bit of that and a little bit of this. Smug Senior has done some work, and so has Frost Saber Matriarch, I think. So, uh, it would be stout, I'm hoping. Survival for the other game? 100% for the other game. That's actually fine. A little bit of Monica in my life. <laughs> A little bit of Rina by my side. Survival. Oh, yeah. MVP the wolf and the mole. Hey, they they double the wolf as blood puppy with a freaking contraband stash. To be fair, I think we won because their recon low rolled <laughs> is what I would say. Unless they actually planned to pick the astral tiger to like win via fatigue or something. I, I don't know. Um, interesting. There has to be some insane play here, right? There has to be some insane play. Coin Power of the Wild. Double one. Actually turns this into a three, two, three, four. Double trade for to play around AOE. Ouch, Lana. Ouch, ouch. Hey, you got a 12, Lana. You gotta take them when they come. You gotta take them when they come. You you won 80% uh, of your games. It's really good. Very, very good. Okay, okay. Uh, now that, that is a feeling I hate. Okay, yeah, that. You wanna hug Lana? You wanna hug to feel better, Lana? Guess he's gonna give you a hug to feel better. Netflix or not, guess he's gonna give you a hug. Alright, can we beat Shaman Wildpaw here? Oh, no match, no match. It's all good, it's all good. Can I not have something that I can maybe Night Captain here, please? Interesting. Interesting. I could have sent those face, but I'm fine doing this. They only have one um, wild poor thing. Hey, I've been evolved for a very long time, blood puppy. I've been evolved for a very long time. They call me Homo. Homo sapiens. Oh, this has to go, chat. How do we kill this? Oh no, how do I... How 
How do I? <laughs> this feels so awkward, Chad. What, what am I meant to do here? Hmm. Mash, mash, face. Uh, we have to use a night captain. The question is on what? I guess this? We have to kill it, right? Uh, it makes our trades really awkward, but we have to kill it. I'm guessing they're always taking this trade, which means we can hero power it, night captain something else. AoE kind of destroys us. I need to go more face. I'm not gonna win full trading, but I have to trade into Raz. I have to take the good trades with Wildpaw, in my opinion. Yeah, they don't, they don't, they don't. That's true, Stout. Frostbite is really good. And I want something that's 5 health here, like a 4-5. Come on, trade, 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 trade. Trading is gonna change the world for me. Trade, 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 trade. Yes. Oh, that's game changing, chat. That's game changing. Because now I hero power the three, four, knight, captain it, trade here. Now we're ahead. I can't do the same next turn because I'm frozen, but I'll take a 6-6. Six, six. Now I can push 8 face. Hopefully draw something solid. So the Night Captains have been good in some of the games. Uh, let's, let's say all of the games. Alright. So I guess we're Raven Idling, and I guess I want a spell. Try and get something to snatch our way out. Mark of the Wild is interesting. Heart of the Wild is, I think, Mark of the Wild. And... This? Someone ate your chocolate? No, Luke, that's not good. That's not good. Get these off of me. Okay, that's a target. So again, I mean, double wild paw, Raz, unbound elemental, frostbite, earthquake is, Who is next on the pretty damn strong. I ain't gonna lie. What's your favorite chocolate chat? Who here likes, I don't know, Kinder Bueno or something like that? That's pretty good, right? I think I have a dairy milk in the, in the in the kitchen. It's also pretty good. What gives me lethal here, chat? Let's see. They probably trade, trade, trade. Technically, I have lethal set up. Um, that helps them clear enough to survive. Oh, I love Ferrero, actually, Blood Puppy. Uh, only Kinder surprise us banned, right, Zuski? Kinder means child in German, if that's what you mean. Or is also Kinder Bueno banned, Zuski? I love Ferrero. Dime? I've had Dime, it's okay. It's like normal milk chocolate, kind of, right? Are you allergic to nuts, Blood Puppy? Lightning. This means they can full clear, right? Yeah, it's Kinder Surprise. To Coco. Oh, wow. Damn, Blood Puppy. I guess we lose here. And again, Raz, Lightning Storm, Beakered Lightning. It's just a bit too much, don't you think, chat? Like, do I play this? I guess I do. Top Deck Fort Captain? <laughs> Maybe. I think nothing really beats this kind of deck. 
I feel like their deck is all insanely premium. I guess Beaker is a bit weak, but it, it won them the, the, the turn over there. Hex. Yeah, we're, we're, we're talking like Earthquake, Hex, Maze Scribe, Raz, Double Wild Spaw, Unbound, Lightning Storm, Frostbite. I, I, I don't really see us getting back here. The only chocolate I can eat more than a bite is a dark one. Oh wow, I find that a bit too harsh and bitter for me. You gave all the sweets away? Yeah. It's just... This is a really good shaman though. It, 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 it's more than an average shaman, right? Like you don't usually see Raz. You don't always see double wild pull. At least as a druid, we did actually play through. A uh, double uh, wild paw somehow. Oh yeah, if you're allergic to cocoa, that's much, right? A bit much. Just don't play your taunt and top deck night captain. That's all I ask. Don't play your taunt. No. Oh wow. Never mind. <laughs> G. G. Alright, next game, chat. I can see. Uh, were they all sweets, or do you call sweets and they were some chocolates? Alright, a bit more chat, a bit more. Can we take it all the way to 12 chat? 12. That's what we want, can we take it to 12? Get our deli, make some good stuff. I'm not sure I've heard of them. Ooh, I haven't had a hot chocolate in a long time. Do you make yours with water or milk? Look. All right, Mr. Jokin. Um, I'm going to full mile for early game. I want twos. I want threes. Um, I want bees. Twos and threes and bees. Caramel chocolate and candies. And you gave that away, Kessie? You gave that away? Pekin? I like Pekins. Oh, there is B. We did get bees. I'm gonna pre-hit this in case I want to bees it next turn. I like hazelnut and chocolate as well. Probably why I like Ferrero as well. That Ferrero is a hazelnut inside, right? Of course, blood puppy. Well, what do you think I am? I'm actually gonna go with Pride Seeker because next turn I can actually Druid Bees for free. Uh, which uh, lets me Bees their 3 drop. Tracking them. They're not gems, they're my friends! <laughs> Alright, so they're trying to set this up. Give it time. The Let's see what we do now. Coin Abomination trade here. They're not gems, they're my friends. <laughs> I just don't have Coin Abomination, alright? But, uh, so are you not gonna eat anything else today, Jesse? Like, no dinner, no nothing? Oh, Void Drinker! That's pretty good, but I'll take it. I love biscuits, Chad. That's what I like. I like biscuits. Chocolate chip biscuits. Cookies, I guess you would call them. I don't know. No, not biscuits like biscuits and gravy or something. Oh my god. 21, 22? Holy crap, dude. That's... That's something. <laughs> That's something, that is. So they can kill this. I want a tower sergeant, but I also want this. Yeah, let's do this. 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 This and face. Two big sandwiches? By big, do you mean the normal sliced loaf of bread that's around that size? That's uh, that's like a little snack pre-dinner, if anything. Yeah, that's... Uh, 
And apart from that, you also ate the most, uh, one of the largest minions in the world. <laughs> Uh, is that a clear? That's a clear. Right, that's always a clear. With a double trade, maybe. I guess they're not doing anything else here, which kinda works. Um, might as well do this. Yeah, it's completely random, right, Puggers? But uh, those are the kind of games that are really entertaining, right? That's all I want. And loads of money. <laughs> Uh, did you build a Lego thing on stream, John? I saw your post last time. What was it? I don't even remember what it was. Shame on me. Shame on me. I ain't no fan, look. I ain't, no, I, ain't, I ain't a fan, to be honest. Trade here. I think we clear this. I could push face. Friday. And what is it again? Let's, let's share with everyone. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna take seven. It's for a thousand followers, right? And what is it again? I, I don't remember, man. Italian cherry marzipan. Huh. A four thousand. Okay, okay. So everyone, chat. John's gonna be building for a thousand follower celebration on his stream. All right. So make sure you're dropping him a follow. Super important, right? Very, very important. Drop him a follow. A 4,800 piece Lego Star Destroyer. That's class right there, Chad. That's class. It's beautiful. I hope I can, uh, I hope I can drop by. I hope I can drop by. It'll take five minutes. Well, uh, now you can uh, follow John. Just in case you unfollowed him, you know? And, uh, watch it. Eight hours? Oh, damn. Double full-blown evil is pretty strong, chat. What do you think? Oh, wow, look. That's really cool. Actually, really cool. Well, I don't think it's a time to celebrate right now, Cassie, for me, if you want me to be honest. Let's try and sell Lethal. And for a thousand, you know what I did for a thousand, Cassie. I told you, if you, if you get a thousand, I'm gonna make my bed. Don't resident sleeper me. You're being rude, Cassie. I don't know whether she did, John, but just in case, just in case. <laughs> Do we have other outs? What about Raven Idol? Like, I assume they're trying to find a way of clearing both of these. That's why I played two. Because one going face is lethal. Unless they obviously find the uh, taunt. That's in our favor. Well, yeah, Night Captain is lethal. Um, Sneaky Scout is not bad because it's a stealth minion. Raven Idol could be lethal. It's one off. Okay. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. We always go face, right? Always face. Always face. One single panther against a warlock army. We're doing it, Ploppy. We're trying. <laughs> We're trying our best. Chad wanted Druid, and I'm uh, trying to see whether Druid can do the winning. <laughs> uh, am I just dead? No, I can't be dead here, right, Chad? Triple. So, wait, this warlock has double full blown evil, triple scarab? That's, uh, that's an interesting one. How are you doing, Bobby? Go, kitty, go. 
Well, honestly, we've had like three turns to top deck Night Captain. So you, you can't call it Algo if we top deck it now. Two turns. Two turns it's been lethal. Three turns it would have helped me get lethal. And we have like a 7% chance to draw it. So over four turns, it's almost a 50% chance to draw it, right? Technically, I mean, it's not cumulative in that way, but... GG. Six wins. <laughs> All right, another one. Another one. Can we get to infinite? <laughs> How in the what in the now what? <laughs> Dude, don't let your boss fire you now, Penhassen. <laughs> That's what we're trying, Blubby. blubby. Single-handedly changing HS replay. I have to admit, we do have a bunch of night captains in this deck, Blubby. Uh, I'll keep one. I guess might as well. <laughs> Even with a bunch of night captains, it's not really getting there. I'm, uh, I'm into it. It's not really getting there. <laughs> yeah, this, uh, Bobby, this has been by far the best druid I've ever drafted for sure. The issue is, I lost against, what was it, uh, a snowfall, I lost against a double wild poor earthquake, double tidal wave shenanigans. You, you just don't really get there, you know what I mean? I'm gonna do this. I could pre-hit. I don't really think I care, then I just go face. The issue is there was a turn um, where we had like triple knight captain in hand and none of them did did anything, remember? Against the Raz or whatever. Okay, Bloodseeker made a difference. But do we do we really, really, really care? Also, a really interesting combo which I've really liked has been uh, the Frost Saber Matriarch, right? We're at 6 and 2 now. Six and two. Ooh, enjoy your pasta poggers. Yeah, bees frost saber is excellent, right? It's gonna become one mana when when frost wolf dies as well. All we have to do is keep going face, lots of face. That's fine. The one three goes in, I assume. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Completely fine. I need even. Ooh. Oh my, can it be? Can we actually get an infinite druid? It will be my first infinite druid chat and my last class to infinite. This meta, this meta. I haven't played a lot of druid, I'm admit. Maybe four? I'm not wishing death, but if it dies, my frost saber is one mana. Let's go. Yeah, I, I I would like to say I got all classes to infinite in the meta. Hydrate, sure, sure. Oh, that's a slow turn, chat. That's infinite right there, chat. Eleven. Lethal. Ooh. Ooh. Alright, right, just a little bit more, Chad, just a little bit more. Didn't even need the Night Captain there, honestly. When this deck curves out... I mean, right, granted, the Night Captain gave me lethal, but I think we would have won the next turn, naturally, um, without the Night Captain. I'm not sure Night Captain is the MVP. I mean, uh, two of the games we wouldn't have won without Night Captain. But uh, I think the coolest combo is Bees Matriarch. 
and even just curving out like arcane anomaly has been really good as well in this deck with bark skin yeah like like this kind of hand right seven win priests what are they gonna do when we arcane anomaly like uh, yeah curve curve let's go let's go let's go that's all we want to do curve probably <laughs> i don't know how many games do you think roughly on average how many games do you think are recorded for arena uh, do i prefer scout uh, i think so more stylish but i was too excited to get uh, i was too excited to get the the seven there i'm gonna be honest Alright, I mean, this is what we want to do, right? Two million? At least a hundred. Well, you could both be right. <laughs> you could both be right. Hey, cloning device? I guess they're gonna get a night captain. What do you think, chat? <laughs> it's uh, quite likely that they get a night captain here. So let's kill them quickly. And uh, next, so they could coin Knight Captain the 3 3, which is fine, really. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Yeah, turn 4. That's, this is how Druid should work. Imagine, Blobby. Arbor up next turn. <laughs> Do you remember that? Sure. Nova's fine. Yeah, I'll Tower Sergeant instead as well, right? Which one do I want to buff? Probably this one. Just imagine Arbor up right there. No, no wonder Druid was toxic. Yeah, exactly. Ugh, shutter. <laughs> uh... Well? Coin... Did they not take Night Captain? Interesting, interesting now, interesting. I think I wanna get rid of my small things, just hero power first. They do survive here, but only just. Don't call it early, Elmo, don't call it early. Well, today has been an eight win day, right? What was it? Eight shaman, eight mage, eight druid. I'm calling it early. Screw it. I'm calling it early. Like, what are they gonna do? You have eight win druid. Let's go. Let's go. Triple eight even. That's like three whole druids worth of wins, <laughs> roughly. I think so, right? This is like a, around 39 to 40% win rate, so what's that? Yeah, that's two wins actually, right? So this is four druids worth of wins. Learn of 12s and 7s. Honestly, if I can get 38 wins in a row, I'd be pretty happy. Will that actually happen? No. It won't, but we can try. Oh, that's a hand. I'm a Chuck Mage Scribe. Hey, congratulations, Lana. You, you got a uh, 50% win rate. That's uh, pretty damn good. So I think, I think I anomaly anyway, because if they're hero powering, that's a win for me. If they don't, I don't know. If they don't, they don't. Oh, they, they top deck to one. That's that's annoying. Because now it makes their hero power nicer, right? 
Oh, that's a better two here in this position. I actually like this uh, druid uh, skin, chat. It's the thousand wind druid. I'm glad I have it. Three hero power. Do I coin direwolf? Frostwolf thingy magic? See what we draw. The ID. Probably worth it. Keep the keep the hero power. Yeah, I think I have uh, six classes. Oh no, I think I would say seven hundred of them are back from my constructed days. I think I already had two classes of thousand wins from my constructed days, and I had another two or three classes in the eight to nine hundred range, another two or three in the seven hundred range. I've hit those to a thousand now from Arena, which is pretty good, not gonna lie, I think. Um, I'm not sure what to do here. I mean, I could double ram to clear this. Is it worth it? Because I, I want a power of the wild ram, right? So maybe we just do this. And just play two of them. I guess I could also buff and value trade, but uh, it's probably better anyway, right, to do this. That would be like 50k gold skin. Wait, for what? I wish there was more for above 1k wins. I want all of them to 1k, but obviously the one I'm furthest away from is Demon Hunter. I'm not even level 60 Demon Hunter yet. Uh, actually, getting to level 60 takes way longer than I remember it taking. I think we just go face. Yeah, you have to remember that I didn't have like 700 win Demon Hunter or something. Uh, actually, Priest and Rogue were my least. Priest and Rogue, I probably had somewhere around 500 wins. I think... And Demon Hunter, I had zero when I came back. So I'm, I'm lucky to have around 300 now, maybe. Hello, Jaybird. Good morning. Good morning. How are you doing? I actually played five... I play a bit more than five constructed matches with Druid this season to get the card back. And that's how I got the thousand wins. Well, I mean, I was already at 997 or something, so it was only a matter of the last few. I'll take a quick look now since we're on EU. It looks like they're a bit stumped here. Never mind. Kill both fours, drop the three one, buff it up. No? Are they gonna hero power instead? Oh, breakfast burrito sounds amazing. Oh, a four four. Oh, they trade there? That's... that's interesting, actually. <laughs> Are you interviewing me, John? I think... Even though we don't have a play next turn yet, I actually think this is the play, which is weird. Feels a bit too good to miss that play. Otherwise, I guess I could have pushed four face, but uh, probably what would happen is by the time we get them down to seven health, uh, just yeah, uh, we lose. The second blood guard is really strong. Archer doesn't do much. Well, it does something, I guess. Good play. Top draw is probably zero. Have you not picked it though? I, I think I have to take the trade. So I guess we're doing this first. <laughs> Look at that! Look at the flower! Oh, it's null. Okay, okay, DID. Abusive? Okay. 
Okay, okay. I mean, they're running out of cards, honestly. We probably value trade here, because if they, if the three won, oh, there's another one. I think we just do this. I'll value trade, though. Uh, idea being that either the three one dies to the two one, or they hero power it, and they take two anyway, is uh, my, my idea. I don't think the two damage phase makes too much difference there. Yeah, so actually the trade left me in a better spot almost, I would say. How do we want to do this? And we have lethal. How does this work? Bam! Nine wins! Oh my god. Can it be Druid? Is my best run of the day? Like, in that game, the curve carried us all the way, I would feel. Curve carried us all the way. The Night Captains are interesting. Yeah, this, this one's probably going on the YouTube, Kessie, because... It's nice to have a high wind druid. Nice to have a high wind druid. Um, so yeah, if you're watching this on the YouTube, like the video, subscribe to my channel, and drop me a comment about whether you would expect it, druid, to even even get the seven, nine even. Wow. Just wow. Is druid your best class of the meta? No, druid's my worst class. I would say Sabola. First time I've gone past infinite with druid. Night Captain's MVP. I would say in three of the games, we wouldn't have won without Night Captain. But in some other games, we won literally without Night Captain. I'm gonna keep this curve. Um, uh, we won specifically without Night Captain, right? In some other games. Uh, because there are some other nice synergies in this deck, like in, in one. Oh, we're gonna get more, Cassie. Don't you worry about it. I'm gonna find a spell here. Draw Proto for when we need it. Sure. Um. Also, by the time they're at this point, Cassie, they're gonna know we have nine. But what I would say is that. This deck has some interesting synergies, and the interesting synergy it comes with the Frost Saber, uh, the Nordrasil Druid, Bees, Barkskins, Arcane Anomaly, Power of the Wild with the tokens. Pretty sweet, pretty sweet. So I could Bees, is it worth it? Probably just Frost Wolf. I might even just keep everything stealth here, take the damage, uh, just to get a tower sergeant out next turn, which I, I like. Yeah, yeah, in this meta? No, no, this is my fourth, I think, Samola, maybe my fifth druid run. I think I've gone two, three, two, three, six with druid, and now nine. It may honestly now be better than Warrior, because I've gone something like 2, 3, 2, 2, 7 with Warrior, maybe. I'm not even sure. Alright, so pays to wait here, so we'll just play this. This, this. And do I care about this free hero power? Might as well, right, in case they have power sergeants and stuff. That's a nice swing. Uh, they could get a Night Captain, and I don't think I could have stopped that. If they get a Night Captain, we can do something ourselves, I don't know. But yeah, to anyone that wants to watch this on the YouTube in full, subscribe to the YouTube. Helps me get to a million subscribers as well, chat. A million subscribers. Think about it. You could have been one of the first million, chat. I know we're a bit far from a million, but a uh, man can hope, a man can dream. Hmm. 
not so much to go. <laughs> Yeah, only 999,900. <laughs> Just stop Nightcapped in my jumping tower, Sergeant. Now I don't think that's worth it. Hmm. I don't know. I could honestly just bees this. Kind of forces an AoE out of them. I don't really have much other better things to do, right? I think I'm fine with it, mainly because I have the play of something like my own Knight Captain to return, right? 6-6 six, six has to be better than 4-4, four, four, even with 3 damage on the board. Yeah, probably still better, so Seb, I think. Okay, there's cycling. That tells me you don't have uh, avalanche thing. Yeah, and get rid of the expensiveness, right, Blobby? Again, no night captain. I kind of wanna. I could just drop this, you know? Let's do it. I know I missed the potential value from it, but uh, if it draws out a hex, takes it away from future night captains, we're kind of happy. That means they don't have an answer. So far, so good. Trade? Even better. Okay, what's the best life we can live? I think I want to buff this since I think they don't have a hex. See what we get. Play Tower Sergeant. And uh, capture the Cold Tooth Mine. So let's start with this. I want to draw my proto for next turn. Let's see what we get. That's actually pretty damn good. I'm gonna do this. I think I'm actually gonna buff this instead. Trade there. Uh, dome. Sure. Let's go dome. So my hand's actually looking good here. And the shaman hasn't done anything scary yet, so they must be drawing badly here at 9. Nice stats. Finger guns right there, stout. <laughs> Very nice stats. The best stats a man can get. I'm saying man because it's this is a man? Undead man, I guess. I, I don't like to be gender specific, okay? That's a good hit, I would say. Uh, double draw is good. Well, we can just push 10 face, drop a Proto Drake. I don't think they have Hex, so uh, it's good, right? My other play is Bunker, Knight Captain, which is also pretty good. I could always do that next turn. Let's uh, try and kill him here. So I could always double Knight Captain face on 10 um, for 6 damage, which means only 6 more has to connect face. I don't think they can kill us here. 15 from hand on 9. What they can do is Tidal Wave. Which is pretty good. Alright, 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 alright. All right. We're dreaming big here, chat. We're dreaming big. Double digit druid. That's a good start for us. No, because it can't. That's uh, the default animated emote from Twitch, which means you apply a spin onto an existing static one. And that's the one they have. What I can do is implement other things like shake, uh, squash, uh, roll in like John's bear, or rave like John's bear as well. Are they trading? Yeah, like like that like that one. I think that one's one of the automated ones, like Taser's Rage one. Eight drops them to nine. Exactly, and there's the slide, like John's slide, and the rave one, like John's cub as well, right? I think we're doing this. I could hero power this, but might as well do this. 
Uh, let's uh, bark skin this out of uh, earthquake range. Eight dome. You always plan lethal, in my opinion, Seb. If they heal, you play around it, but you always do it. There's the earthquake. I'm so glad I played around that. I'm so glad I played around that. I still would have had lethal, but uh, you know, just a little, uh, little uh, tap on the back, chat. Pat on the back. Double digits. I'm just happy to be here. Ooh, baby. Ah, we're on a roll, chat. We're on a roll. We're on a roll. Not a bread roll. Uh, a Hearthstone Arena winning roll. Alright, just a little bit more, chat. Two more games to win. Two more games to win. Ooh. You received a pat on the back today? Yeah, yours wasn't a good one, I think, Kessie. <laughs> Demon Hunter, ain't nice to see a 10, chat. We need a good starting hand. Are you playing Pokemon? I'm a, I'm a chap, please. I'm actually not happy to see Double Knight, Captain. Demon! Okay, that's the kind of thing I want to see. Curve, curve, curve. Less scary than Shaman? Not, not with Druid in my opinion, Seb, because uh, Demon Hunters go wide early game is how they win, and Druids have no answers. My hand isn't really that good though right now, chat. It looks premium, but it's really not. <laughs> yeah, and this is how you lose, right? Now I just lose. This is what I mean, Seb. How do I answer this as Druid? I expected them to have Vanguard, so uh, that means I just lose, right? I have to hero power trade, I guess? Sure. Always happening. Discover a spell. Try and find bees. A buff. This is too slow. I actually might take Lightning Bloom. So if I take Lightning Bloom next turn on 4 and play it, I can Night Captain. But then on 5, I'll only have 3 mana, which sucks. So I'll take Power of the Wild. Probably go Hero Power 3 2 into Night Captain, Night Captain, Night Captain. So basically, if they play into Night Captain, which it seems like they don't. Um, we should be okay. Our sergeant doesn't do much. I'm gonna start hitting this out of the way. Let's see, they probably double trade the ones, uh, which means I probably knight captain the basilisk, I would say. It depends, we'll see. Oh, buff the basilisk. Yes! <laughs> Oh yes, exactly! Oh my god, you couldn't have done something worse there! Oh my no, no 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 <laughs> oh my god. I, I feel like thanking him, but at the same time I feel like that's BMing, so I'll, I'll refrain. But uh, yeah, non-sniper confirmed is uh, about right. I wish I could hero power knight captain, what do you think? This ain't bad. Buff, <laughs> buff the cobalt. Fine, do you win? Um, what do we do now? I guess we play another one? What do we think? Can't fit in the hero power. Maybe just go dome? I could play this as well. Yeah, let's play this. Force the 5-5. Five five. Tower and hero power. The thing with with the, the Matriarch is if we pick up bees, it basically becomes free. It kind of does the same thing. The issue with playing tower is I assume they basically kill the 6-6, six, six, right? With the 5 and hero power. I could do this, though. Try this. Oh, 
That means next turn I can take the damage. I can kill the 5-5 five five maybe. If they value trade. Figure Sarge is the same as Matriarch. Uh, Matriarch forces the trade is the difference, right, Stout? So the reason I like this a little bit is... If they decide to trade into the Night Captain, they probably buff the scrap on the Tiger, which means I can hero power it anyway. And if they do that and trade into the 4-4, I can Night Captain it. And if they don't use it and trade into the 4-4, I can hero power it. Which means... I should be fine no matter what. It was a chat vote, Demon. I just gave a uh, chat the vote and they chose Druid. So we played Druid. Alright, alright, alright. <laughs> I, I like a little bit of variation. I do get bored playing the same classes. Okay, so are they killing the Night Captain as we predicted? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, they're not using their face though. But that's fine. So we just take another 5 here, which is a bit unfortunate, but I think we do it. And I think now we're a bit scared, so we do want to start trading, I think. Protect our little Night Captain again. I'm scared. They had a Vanguard. They probably have Inquisitor. This burrito about to be so good. What did you put in it, Jaybird? Wait, I actually have a question. Something I don't know. Is breakfast burrito like a staple set of ingredients? Or is it just a generic term for a burrito in the morning with a typical set of ingredients? And then you can uh, mix and match or whatever. Nova? Oh, their own Night Captain. Okay. Sure. Means they're taking six, though. Next on the chopping block? They're still one turn away from uh, too many shenanigans, I would say. I think we just mash face, right? So, they. How much damage can they do on eight? Not a lot, right? There's obviously some leeway, but yeah, they generally have eggs. Interesting, interesting. I think we're doing this. Eggs, mushrooms, pepper, sausage, tomatoes, and hot sauce. That does sound really good though, Jaybird. I love mushrooms. Hot sauce, also love it. Eggs are fine. Green peppers are fine, cooked. I'm not a huge fan of raw green peppers. Okay, that means they're taking damage. Which is fine. I like the value trade here because it gives me my own Night Captain, right, chat? So this always happens. The question is, do I buff here? I think I summon a beast. And smirk. The reason I summoned the Panther is just to be able to cheat out the Matriarch. Uh, Cycle, Inquisitor. Does Inquisitor kill me? 8, 9 and 11, 15. They're one off with Inquisitor, right? Right? 8, 9 and 11, 15. They're one off, right? GG. Garbox says Miss Lethal. Did I miss Lethal? I had. They were at. What were they at? Eight or nine? Three damage face. Six, seven, eight. If they were at eight, I did miss Lethal, which is actually rough. I'm glad I won anyway. Were they at eight? Are we sure they were at eight? Oh my, Jaybird. Alright, final boss chat. 11. If they were at 8, that is missed lethal because I had 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Exactly. I'm not sure, were they at 8? Were they at 9? 
We're in there at nine. Kind of curious. Uh, let's load this up. Final bus, chat. Final bus. Uh, they were at nine, chat. Oh, we had the hero power. Flip me. All right, all right, all right. We had the hero power. Thank you, Redbeard. Holy crap. All right, we're gonna try. We're gonna try. We had the hero power, of course. Hey, right, chat. I think at this point... I may be slightly tired. <laughs> no, it was lethal. It was lethal, though. It was lethal. Uh, my miss. But we won anyway, so... Uh, my play was the correct play, chat. It was... Uh, it was about letting them think they won with Inquisitor. <laughs> Thank you. There, see? 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 Alright, all right, a little bit more, a little bit more. Last game, let's go. Last game either way, chat. Last game either way. Paladin? I don't know about Paladin. We're, we're gonna try. I'm gonna just keep the two here. Suspense for YouTube? Yeah, I'll take it. Suspense for YouTube. There we go. I mean, uh, nobody's even gonna freaking expect a druid on YouTube, I think. Okay, okay, getting this. <laughs> Most probably. Okay, so we're expecting bridge, triple Templar captain. I don't know. Um, they don't really have a way of dealing with wider boards. Let's do this. You don't, right? You actually don't, Seb. Like, Shaman and Demon Hunter, I would expect. Coin... Spring Rocket? Huh. Alright, I mean, sure. We don't really have much to do here, but we can start going face. Hand buff BS. I mean, so far, they've just coined a spring rocket, so it's looking good. But, uh, our hand isn't. <laughs> Maybe we can pick up Frostwolf, D.I.D., Tower Sergeant, a 4, basically. Uh... Okay, 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 okay. Come on, we have to make this last game a good game, chat. We have to make this last game a good game. That's fine. Top deck Bunker Sergeant. Ah, uh, well, we tried. Um, I could bark skin here. Seems fine. Trade, hero power. I could broom, but I feel like I need broom later. I also want to trade a bit. I think this happens and this happens. The question is, what do I do here? I think this goes face, and I buff it. Could buff this. Play a tiny bit around Consecrate. I do need to kill them before then, but I also need to draw a tiny bit better if we hope to do that, the wall. Maybe not this way. <laughs> Maybe not this way. I, I mean, uh, I think this deck does have some 2, 3, and 4 drops, I would say. Just a tiny bit. But they, they've, they're playing an, a weird, awkward deck as well, chat. They're also playing an awkward deck so far. 2, 2 is fine. 2 is safe. That's annoying, but 2 is safe-ish. Uh, okay. So, I'll go with Smug. I'll take this trade. Go face. Kind of don't let them be able to kill the Smug scene here. Not like this. Hey, Jaybird, if we lose here, I'll freaking take 11, man. Yeah, there, there, there's a... Uh, it's been the hardest equivalent of a slap fight. Yeah, at, uh, <laughs> at least bees is good. Bees, this. Now what else are we doing? I guess we try and find a spell here. I don't like finding a minion from this for some reason. I could f 
Feral Rage, this. Sure. And hey, we're both running out of cards here, honestly. So far, I don't think they've had an insane deck. Our cards are looking better. We still have our good cards in the deck. No walls can hold me. That kind of scares me, though. That kind of scares me. I don't want to kill this. I know, Blubby, I know. I may Spectral Senior here. Yeah, they're gonna have a Templar probably, right? So I, I don't want to kill this yet, but... Uh, it's gonna have Rush, so it doesn't really matter anyway. The reason I like keeping Hidden Oasis is uh, that I have Pride Seeker. So let's just do this, I guess. I mean, the play might be to kill this if the A-drops are in their hand, but you never know. <laughs> the abandoned god. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. This is weird. This is weird. Like, Vanguard at 11 win Paladin. Well, that means the 3-3 three isn't dead. Which is a good sign. Which is a good sign. Do I kill this? Fantasy nerd. You don't like, uh... You don't like Lord of the Rings, Blubby? Kill it. I, I don't even know here. I, mean, I could kill this with my hero power. I don't think it's worth it. I think we do this. I could broom, but I want to keep broom for later. Need hello beastly farts. Welcome to the stream. Colossus of the Moon versus Rune Spear in a control arena deck. Probably Rune Spear in that case, I would say. It's also more fun. It may low roll sometimes, but uh, it should help you get there. Appreciate the follow. I know, Blubby. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> okay. They're not killing it. Does that mean I should try to kill it myself, chat? What do you think? Six zero demon hunter. I give me say. Let's just play the six six. This. I kind of want the hero power though, but at the same time, I don't. Let's do this. Yeah, maybe they're bluffing, Seb. Let's see. Six zero demon hunter. My opponents cheat out Ivis from Dark Peddler. Plays on 7, still got the board. Top decks Knight Captain into Siphon. Take your Void Hound. Ouch. Divine Shield is not Pharaoh's Blessing. That's a good sign. 8, 9, 10, 11. We're too off lethal. No. Did they just draw that? They just drew that. That's fine. We're not scared of their 1-1. One, one. Um, yeah, we're not scared, right? We're not scared. Okay, okay, okay. So let's start by sending this dome. Probably Avenge, I would say, so we just ignore them, right? It could be Sacred Trial, though. Shit. I'm actually gonna kill one. Oh, auto defense. That's fine. Doesn't matter if I go face here. If I go face next turn, I have nine because they just kill these two. So maybe I do kill this. Nah, it doesn't even matter at this point, right? Maybe I should have just gone full face, but I was scared of Sacred Trial, chat. I was scared of Sacred Trial. I actually recently got hate mail on Reddit. One of the things he complained about was me criticizing Lord of the Rings on the stream. Nah, you're entitled to criticize it, man. If that's what you want. Sure. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm thinking, Blubby. Hey, Mofundi. 
An average druid is still bad. That's not gonna change it. Let's go dome. Everyone, hands together. But Mufundi, it's been a good run. Win, it's much fun funnier than losing. The tip of the day by Gropis. Oh, Mountain Bear! <laughs> but they got a taunt. They got a taunt. They got a taunt too. Oh my, oh my. There's a Basilisk. Oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my. Oh my. Well, we have four Knight Captains, chat. Four Knight Captains. Is this lethal? Five? No, not lethal, not lethal. We can only perfectly get through, chat. So what, what are we doing? This? This? This, this, this? We actually, chat? Four out of 14 cards are Knight Captains. Four? Out of 14 cards, are Knight Captains. One off again, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, they could have Ivis. Swash. Oh yeah, yeah, it's more than one and three. We're talking about... Oh no, it's not more than one and three. Not even a Knight Captain taking us to freaking... 12 wins with a druid. 12 win druid, chat. It's 4 on 14, Seb. Holy crap. Thank you, Rudy Groovy Brutus. There's a 12 winner druid, chat. There is a 12 win druid. Wow. At Mephundi, it was a great run. I will admit that. It was a great run. It was a great run. I think it was fun. I think it was fun. I enjoyed it. Arch, thank you for the cheer. Nature Bomber. Let's check out the rewards, but heck, this is going on the freaking YouTube. A druid in this meta? Blobby coming in with the cheer too. Thank you so much, Blobby. And the wall! Thank you so much for the cheers. Kicking off the hype chain, look at that. But yeah, this run's going on the YouTube. This run is going on the YouTube for sure. 12 win Druid, let's go. Exactly, let's go. If you're watching on the YouTube, please remember to like the video, subscribe to my channel, and leave me a comment down below about whether you thought this Druid would go infinite, or whether you thought it would go 12, or whether you thought it would go 0 and 3. But either way, a lovely freaking surprise and finally high rolling some gold too. Hope you enjoyed that. I'll catch you next time.